The last time we played Grounded together, I was going into an anthill. I got a little ways into playing into this game, and I got braver as well. There are a lot of things that I was afraid to do that I'm willing to do now. Like, for instance, fight spiders. I think I've killed, at this point, 20 of them. Or maybe 30, 50, 60, 100. I don't know. A lot of spiders. Particularly the orb weaver spiders. They're not as tough as they look. You know, and as long as you dodge and you parry, which you naturally understand if you watch my videos, that I'm really good at parrying things. You know, if you don't have parry experience, you might find it a little bit difficult. But they don't do that much damage when you have the acorn armor on, which I don't, I'm not even wearing. Why am I not wearing my acorn armor? Oh wait, I remember now. It's because building this takes ages. I don't have really a roof on this. I just got, you know, kind of a, a sunroof. I don't know what else to call it. Whenever you wear the ant armor when you're farming stuff like stems and leaves, you can carry more leaves, which is like a haul bonus. You can carry more and carry up to eight, whereas opposed to when you're not wearing it, you carry five. But these are the pallets for it, and it took me, I think, three hours just to make this. Not to mention, I had to go to Bum Freak Egypt in order to get all of the stems I needed in order to make the stilts. But hey, you know, it came out good. Check me out. Check me out. I got a water container today. Does it hold any water? Because I don't know how to get water in it. A slurpy machine, or a smoothie machine rather. When you kill grubs, they give you grub goop. You can make smoothies with that. Naturally, you cook food here. And here is a spindle, which I think I was using it to make rope. Yeah, you just put materials in it, like this, and like that. When you put the materials in, you just let it go and do its thing, and it turns it into rope for you. So I need the silk rope because I'm trying to accomplish something which is going to be our main objective for this video. When you go into the armor section for crafting, you look and you see that I have 14 ladybug parts and there's the ladybug armor, which is what I want to make in this video. So I need berry leather. Berry leather is something that I don't have and it's not easy to come by. Well, well, actually, it's not easy to come by in the area that I'm in. I don't even think it drops here. It drops near a place called the Hedge, and the Hedge is a little bit of a tougher area that I have not been to yet, and I've been kind of scared to go. So, in this video, we're gonna go to the Hedge, we're gonna get some leather, we're gonna come back, I'm gonna put on this ladybug armor, which I already got what I need for that, and what do the leg pieces need? Need more berry leather, so I need, I probably need to, I'm gonna need to kill one more ladybug if I look at it. I'm gonna get that armor set, and once I get it, I'm gonna come back home, and we're gonna kill ourselves a wolf spider. So I found a good vantage point so I can show you exactly where we're going. We're going over there. That's the hedge. If I go over there, get the berries, and I can craft this armor, I will be immensely more strong and in a better defensive position to fight anything. So I need to go over there, get that, and then... That's when the real adventure is going to begin. Now, you have to be careful over here because over here are bombarder beetles. They're real close to this area. I killed one of them over here once before. Ah, there we go. Does he see me? Nah, he doesn't. There's a lot of these damn Say goodbye to your kneecaps, chucklehead. Oh. Is he killing them? Police! Help! Well, that's awesome. We can see him fight in action. You just lose this shotgun move. Get on out of here, buddy. Just go find something to do. I don't want to ah. fight you. Please don't see me. Please. He's chilling. And he can shoot at me, so I can shoot at him. He saw me. <laughs> I don't want to fight. Please leave me alone. Go away. Get the freak out of here. I'm joking. No, stop, stop. Right now, areas with green grass seem to be the safest for me to travel in because I'm familiar with all of their predators. Oil believers, larva, stuff like that. Okay, the grass is getting kind of dry over here. It's not a good sign. Whenever you see dry grass, it just means that you're entering a domain that's going to have different predators. <gasps> but enough small talk, it seems as though we have made it safely onto the branch. And I also don't see any predators close or near. And I see berries. And I have my bow. So you know what that means. It's time to get busy. Ugh. It just plop down and turn to mush thank you let's go berry chunks now i gotta somehow turn them into leather but i'm gonna worry about that when we get to that point i'm gonna set my spawn point so that way if i die i just come right back here it's kind of strange that i don't see any spiders around here but i think the reason i don't is because we're near an area where bombarder beetles and larvae hang out so because they hang out here 
just so they probably don't want to scrap all the time and fight all of the time they're probably more towards the left of the establishment so as long as i stay this direction i should be cool and here's a berry free product let's go it's so weird there's so many just free bugs hanging out around here this place should be spider infested i was expecting to run into at least 10 15 20 spiders on my trip here and we got a little radio it's unpowered so i can't use it resource analyzer let's go ahead and analyze these berry chunks so i can see if it's gonna give me the recipe for berry leather it did let's go I think later on maybe in my own time or like i said far later on i'm gonna build an area over here that i can sleep at like you know an actual house that's protected because a lot of the story or a good decent chunk of it is gonna take place underneath this hedge so i can set up an area just chill just relax i don't think there's any bugs in the tree itself i think they're all on the ground up underneath me at this very point i'm just gonna look around see what i can find Hey, where's you from? Girl? Oh, a spiderling. A oh, he fast. Spider. Is he gonna jump? Kinda cute in a in a creepy. Sort Boy, that of is not cute. You tripping? Ah, that is horrifying. <laughs> the boy ran up fast. But uh, I think this should do it. Y'all could come up. Y'all could come up if you want. Now don't run. Don't run. I'm on your level now. He's still running. Beep. Where you at? I only give you web fiber. Okay, then I'm not gonna make it a priority to kill them. I was hoping for new materials. Man, there's so much stuff up here. This is awesome. And they put juice boxes in the trees? Who puts juice boxes in the hedge? What kind of kid used to live here? Littering bastard. Can I hit this without it falling? Nope. No. No, come back! This little dude is trying his hardest to find a way to get me. The zip line is kind of concerning. I know over here it's safe. Like if I look down, you see there's nothing beneath me. You know, from what I can see presumably. There's no spiders, no nothing. Right there is a web. <laughs> Two webs in fact. And it's leading to a far side of the tree. And I, to be honest, I kind of lost track of where I placed my lean to. There it is. There's my lean to. Okay, I can find it. I just got to look for that thing. Can you do me a favor and not fall? No! My axe is about to break. Maybe you noticed it and you're like, dude, fix your axe. I have an insect axe or at least the materials I need in order to build it. So I'm not too scared of that. If this one breaks, then what's that noise? Huh? You always got to be vigilant. You got to pay attention to your surroundings. Anything could sneak you at any time. No cap. Let's ride the zip line though. Nothing but spider webs. Let's go. Oh, it's just you? What's up? No. I told y'all. Oh, he juked me. Where do you go? He pairs. What's that over there? Oh, it's a lab entrance. Let's go. I'm definitely going over there. Is that a spider egg sack? Yeah. Oh, it's two of them. Okay. Yep. I told y'all I'm freaking Perry King. Nah, where you going? They're good at dodging. They're actually really good at that. Wait, a stink bug sack. <gasps> Ooh, good stuff, good stuff. I need to find more of those. I think when I use those, I can build different things. What? Oh, they can't climb. Oh, just like, oh! Bruh, 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 bruh. Why, why, why am I freaking out? Why am I freaking out? I'm good. I'm good. I'm Gucci. I finally took a nap, and after I woke up, the situation is still as crystal clear as it was before I went to sleep. I'm just trying to get back over there and collect those stink sack eggs, and then we'll really be in business cooking with the sauce. Because I think the first one that I broke dropped one of those stink bug cartridges. I think I can use them to make a gas mask or something like that. Ooh, get dodged. Get juked, boy. Oh, oh, okay. Take them serious. You gotta take them serious. They always run. That's always their first instinct. It's the, ooh, nice. I'm telling you, boy, these guys are a little bit agile. They move a little bit. I like that. Now, wait a minute. All right. Be careful, bro. You never know what's gonna pop out. You really never know. Oh, God, it's a bunch of them. It's four. 
your stink bug parts. Yes, sir. That's exactly what I need. With that, I can build a gas mask. Mm, two for one. I think there was one more. This is only three bodies. That was a oh 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 god. Why? Why do they do this to me? It's trying to glitch me off of the tree trunk. That's the second time that happened. Anyways, let me clear out some space. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm gonna get rid of this. And I'm gonna get rid of this too. Bro, what are you talking about? I have stink bug parts now and bombarder parts. Two for one special. Now let's get into this lab up here. Now you might be thinking to yourself, hey, why did you destroy your berries to clear inventory space? Truth be told, I don't know why I did that. And second, you might be thinking, why did you destroy the webs in your inventory just to pick up more webs? I also don't know the answer to that question. See, sometimes I do things without thinking. There's a disc over there. Ooh, raw science. I'm gonna get that raw science. Dang, boy, so many egg sacks here. I, I don't have time. I need y'all to leave. Like, I, I low-key might die. I'm just trying to make it to this branch. Let's go. Whoa, what is that? What the fuck? Stop playing. What the what heck the is fuck? this? Stop playing. What the fuck is that? It's freaking ah! huge. It's huge. You know there are spiders in here. You know it. You know it. Look at the size of this opening. Ooh, and it's ambient. Huh? It is ambient. What is that? Oh, it's this dead ant. Soldier ants at that. Woo! What the f Oh, sheesh. Look at all these bugs. They just they just sitting here. Carcasses. Why am, why am I brave enough to... Why was I brave enough to walk in here? I'm out. I'm leaving. Okay, bye. But it, it doesn't look like there's anything in here. And there's like humongous eggshells over there. Something's gonna pop out on me if I walk through here. I just wanna see it. I'll just come back and get my stuff if it does. Woo! I'm good. I'm good. I'm not nervous. I'm fine. I'm well equipped. Brood Mother BLT. <gasps> oh, I do know what this is. Okay, so this is an area where the Brood Mother spawns. It's supposed to be the only boss that they have in the game right now. And it's huge. It's massive. I, why did I. Bruh, I can't believe. Why did I walk in here? I'm out. I was wondering where it was. I heard. Like, I watch videos about it, but I watch videos of people fighting it. I've never seen the actual entry before, so now I know the entrance is over here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far, drop a like. If you came from TikTok, I just want to thank you for stopping by. I appreciate the view, and if you like it, stay for more. Later.